Hi, and welcome to Digital Tech Reviews and Tips, guys. Today I'm going to be unboxing the Blade 350QX RTF by Horizon Hobby. Now, this product is so popular because it is able to fly a GoPro camera, and so you can get some sweet aerial footage. It's pretty much priced the same as the Phantom DJI, or the DJI Phantom, that is, ready-to-fly version, the first version, not the second one. The second version is about $800, $900. The first version goes for about $470, $460. And that's what I picked this one up for. I picked it up for $470. You can get the BNF, which is bind and fly, which comes without a radio, for about $430. But I decided to make it simple, get a radio with it, and so you can fly right out of the box and not have to worry about setting that up. This is going to test my capabilities of unboxing because it is a very large box. It's also a pretty cool box, honestly, if you get a close-up there of how it's like a textured surface. I don't know. It's a nice touch, but I'll probably throw the box away, or maybe I'll use it as a storage case. Who knows? I decided to go with this rather than the DJI Phantom, which is a very popular product, because a lot of people said that this is a lot easier to set up out of the box, and that the DJI Phantom also requires a PC, which I actually don't have access to. I'm running pretty much all Macs nowadays, guys. Yeah, that's kind of sad. But, I don't know, maybe one day I'll get a PC again. Anyways. Here we have it. Pretty big box with nice handle. I expect they do think that you might be using this as a uh, carrying case because they do include a handle. And yeah, on the side you can see here it has safe, smart mode, stability mode, agility mode. It has a GPS and a return home function and it is compatible with the GoPro. This does not have a gimbal on it. However, Horizon Hobby recently released a version which does have a gimbal so you can buy that gimbal and put it on this. Now this also that you can notice down here, it is optimized with firmware 2.0, which includes some upgrades to the overall, you know, operating system that the uh, 350X QX Blade runs. So that's enough of the talk, guys. I just get right to unboxing it, and as you can see here when you open it right up, you maybe I'll turn it around. There you go. Uh, right here on the top, you have your instruction manual, and you have uh, warranty, I'm guessing. And you also have here these little uh, aluminum foil kind of thingies. And I'm, well, the guy at the hobby store was telling me that these are actually for putting it around, like, the GoPro camera area. So that it doesn't, me like, the 2.4 gigahertz radio doesn't mess with the GoPro. And you don't have any issues on those communication, you know, when you're flying. You don't want any accidents. So this will prevent any glitches and stuff like that from happening due to the uh, 2.4 gigahertz frequency and stuff. So that's kind of cool that they added this. And you just gotta make sure you use it because, and do it right because that's, you don't want issues of that nature. <laughs> so you can pop off foam there and here you instantly have everything that you get in the kit. Uh, you got your Blade 350QX, your radio. They include some, maybe, some AA batteries here. It's always a nice touch, you know. Don't have to go hunting to get a new pair. Uh, what else you got here? You got some uh, vibrations, uh, shocks. I mean, this is for the shocks on the, uh, what's it called? The GoPro mount. I'm pretty sure these are what it's for. I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. Uh, they also do include one battery. You can pick up another battery. Uh, anywhere, Amazon, online. By the way, guys, links are down below to all these products. It really helps if you buy through them, as it does support the show. It's a 30C capacity um, discharge, uh, 3S LiPo battery, 200, two, 222, or 220, wow, 200. You get the number. You can see it right here. You can read the facts. It's pretty good. You know, you definitely could get higher discharge rate, but you have to be careful that it actually still fits in the uh, blade because it does have limited room. And here they do include a charger, very simple LiPo charger, you know, you got two cell, three cell, switch, select, you can select your amperage. It's, I mean, it's at least better than just one that can only work with the blade battery itself, so that's kind of nice. Don't know if they include a adapter. It looks like you might just have to run off DC power. I'm going to be using one of the chargers that I have because it's digital and it just makes it easier and everything. Here they include the GoPro mount right here. And you can see, figure out my GoPro, and it does fit it. 
very nicely. Very nice. Yeah. It fits the GoPro. This is a 3 Plus right here. And so it fits it, and I can't wait to get that buddy up in the air. Now, what else you got in here? Looks like you got your shock mount plate for, that's what these little guys go to. And you sandwich it together like that, and then your one end goes to the copter's bottom, and the other one, you attach that GoPro mounting thing too. And then you have your thing on the bottom. It works to somewhat reduce vibrations. There's a lot of tricks people have found to reduce vibrations even more. So it's helpful that people are working to find those. I'll pull out the radio maybe if I can get it out first. I usually like to leave the quadcopter to last because that's the big thing. But maybe now there we go. So they include a spectrum radio. Uh, nothing fancy, you know, no digital thing, but it's included with a kit, so you can't really expect them to be too fancy. It's 2.4 gigahertz spread spectrum. Very good. I just purchased a spectrum radio actually for my RC cars, and so far, really no complaints. It operates smoothly. I like that they do four batteries, it keeps the weight down. You don't get tired holding it. And yeah, it seems very plasticky, but that's kind of what you get. The sticks feel pretty good, and you got your switches for your other channels there. And then we'll get to the quadcopter itself. I like that they also include some spare rotors, a whole set of spare rotors, because that can keep down the cost before you have to buy more rotors, you know, because you're always gonna break rotors eventually, even if you don't plan on it. And I really, guys, I gotta say, I like the looks of the Blade 350QX a lot better than the DJI Phantom. I mean, I know you can upgrade the DJI Phantom a lot more. This It has a lot more room in there for putting upgrades and it's a lot more, more modular, I think is what people say. But, you know, this is really just looks a lot sleeker, a lot nicer, not as boxy as the DJI Phantom. Looks aren't everything though, but it does perform um, better. It has more agility if you're looking for that. So I don't know. I decided to go with this rather than the DJI Phantom. You might decide to go with that. Definitely there's tons of people talking about it, so you should not have um, be at a lack of sources and people discussing it, discussion boards and videos and such. So yeah, if you have any questions about this product right here, um, leave them down below. Subscribe to my channel to get notified when I upload new videos. I'm doing a ton of GoPro stuff. I also have a new drone coming in, uh, the Pocket Drone Tricopter, which I got off Kickstarter. It should be in by the end of August, September. Can't wait to get that. That's actually, I was holding off buying this, but I decided that I couldn't wait any longer and I just decided I need to get it. Need for speed, yeah. I don't really need it, guys, but I wanted it, so. Um, yep, subscribe, like, comment, you guys know what to do. I'm on Facebook, Twitter, also now Instagram. Tons of cool pictures that I decided I should do something with and I just made an Instagram, so go there if you like photos. And you know guys, that's really about it. Um, I hope you liked this video, I hope you found it somewhat helpful and not a complete waste of time. And if you're still watching guys, uh, I hope you enjoyed the video and as always, have a nice day.